Hello everyone, my name is Shireen, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new Minecraft tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Minecraft 1.14 brand new textures in any version of Minecraft. And obviously I'm going to do this for Mac OS as well. So let's just jump straight into it. So the first thing you're going to need to do is open a new Finder window. So I'm going to do this via my Macintosh HD. Um, you're going to go to your home folder which is right here, you're going to go to library, application support, scroll down to Minecraft, then you're going to go to versions. Now in here you're going to want to find a brand new like Minecraft 1.14 snapshot. If you don't use Minecraft snapshots, you probably won't have any of these folders. If, if you want to find out how to get these folders and download a Minecraft snapshot, leave a comment down below and I will make a completely new video on that. But as I have those folders, I'm going to use the most recent snapshot folder which is 18w45a we're going to go in here and we're going to copy or drag this um, jar file to our desktop right here so let's do that and we're going to open this with archive utility which is going to give us, ac give us access to all the files inside the folder in the jar file i should say okie dokie so in here we're going to find a lot of files, we're going to go kind, we're going to drag the pack image onto our desktop, we're going to drag the pack.mc meta onto our desktop as well, and then we're going to go to assets, minecraft, and then we're going to take the block states, texts, uh, textures and models and drag those onto our desktop. And then from here we're going to make a new folder called assets as you just saw in the minecraft folder we're going to open this folder and we're going to make a new folder in here called minecraft no um, capitals okay and then we're going to take the texts that <laughs> sorry <laughs> the text textures block states and model folders and we're going to put them in here and that's the assets folder done. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take the assets folder, the pack mc meta and the pack image. We're going to right click that and compress these three files. And that's going to go down into a zip folder, which is the format for resource packs in Minecraft. And then we're going to name this Minecraft 1.14 pack. Now, if you want this for, say, Minecraft 1.12 or Minecraft 1.13, you're going to actually have to edit the pack folder. That might seem a little bit complicated, but don't worry, it's one of the easiest things to do. So basically what you do, you right click your pack um, folder or file, open it with text edit and change this number here. Uh, so you see the four right here. You change that to the version of the pack that you want. So if you want uh, 1.14 is 4, 1.13 is 3, 1.12 is uh, 2 I think it is, and anything below 1.12 is 1. So then, then you need to go back into your finder folder, go to your Minecraft folder again, so home page, library, application support, Minecraft, this time go to your resource packs folder, there we go, and then we're going to drop the Minecraft 1.14 pack into this folder right here and I have an old one so I'm going to replace that one. There we go. So now you can open Minecraft with whatever version you want. I'm going to open 1.13 and I'll be back to show you the texture pack working in Minecraft 13. Okay everyone we are back and before I show you the actual resource pack work and I have to say that I had some difficulty with this because macOS does something that really annoys me and I haven't had it happen for a very long time but basically when I opened the pack um, it changed the, what's it called, the apostrophes in the pack. Uh, so let me show you this real quickly. It's, so, it's such an annoying thing, but it happens all the time. And you wouldn't even notice it unless you tried the pack in Minecraft. So basically, when I went into Minecraft, the pack wasn't working. I've literally done this a hundred times and I couldn't work it out until I finally looked at the pack myself and then finally figured it out. So here is our pack that we made. So 1.14 pack. Open this and I'll show you what the issue was. It's such a small thing, but if you miss it, it misses up the whole thing. So I open. So what I've done basically, I made a brand new um, MC meta uh, file in text edit, and then called it .mc meta. Open this again. And basically, what macOS does, it changes the apostrophe. So you see this apostrophe right here. 
it's just two straight lines but what mac os done was it changed it to let me see if i can actually duplicate it i don't know if it's gonna work so it's changed it to this and it's a very small thing but it is so annoying and you can see the difference between it as well if i um make this a little bit bigger you can see the difference between this apostrophe and this apostrophe so this apostrophe here doesn't work in minecraft this is the only apostrophe that worked and when i done the original pack that was the apostrophe that uh, the Mac OS was using. And it's just a <laughs> really small thing. And my correction as well, I have another correction, which is um, uh, pack format 4 is actually for 14 and 1.13. And everything downwards um, is 1.12, 1.11. And everything, I think everything below 1.11 is um, pack format 1. So that's fine now. So it actually works now, so I have to correct that. <laughs> so sorry for going off a tangent, but macOS is really annoying sometimes. So I'm going to delete this one. Now let's go back into Minecraft, go options, obviously, resource packs. We scroll down, and then our Minecraft 1.14 pack is right here. We press done, and then we can make a new world, for example. Let's just jump into a new world really quickly. So let's make a new world, let's do anything, let's do creative and then create it. And then I'll show you that the textures are actually working in Minecraft 1.14. Alright, so here we are in our new Minecraft world. And you can see that the textures are brand new. So the leaves are different, the oak's different, the birch is definitely different as well. And you can clearly see that this is working. Let's go over to the pumpkin. I think he, Jasper changed the pumpkin. And one thing I do love, I love the stone textures now. Look at this, absolutely amazing. So that is how to get... The Minecraft 1.14 textures in any version of Minecraft. As usual, I'll leave all of the links, I'll leave all the information that you need below. I'll even leave the instructions down there. Um, and also I'll put the warning about the apostrophes in there as well. And did he retexture? I don't think did he retexture the dogs? Maybe a little bit. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry it was a little bit of, you know, <laughs> confusion, but Mac OS does that sometimes. Uh, so I will see you in the next video. Peace out and have fun with your new Minecraft textures.